Going in the combine, guys? Okay, let's go. Nice and slow. Keep both your hands on at the same time. Okay, I'm behind you. Keep both your hands on at all times. These guys are going to go for a ride. I'm going to go in there too. Looks like there's enough room. It's a big machine. Or small, depending on your area and your field sizes. I'm coming up too. Who's driving, Uncle Mike? Nothing so to your fans. <laughs> how about you, Wes? Is this fun riding that combine? I can't believe how quiet you guys are. I'm actually surprised they're still awake. Kids love falling asleep in machines like this and tractor rides. goes on more
have to go meet up with them somewhere else. I got a long walk, it looks like. Fun stuff. Now they're filling these things up pretty quick today, those trailers. They're getting full in a hurry. In the buggy. I don't know if they're coming back. I better watch my back. There they come. They still look like they're awake. I need a combine cab and a simulator at home so because they're really quiet when they're in there. Not a peep coming out of their mouth for daddy's sake. <laughs> Gotta be aware of my surroundings there. They can't see when they're backing up in these fields, so be really careful and know what's around you. Comes one of the trucks, and uh, we're gonna go for a ride to the elevators with uh, Uncle Andy here. See if everyone's still awake in the combine. Should be appearing here. There they come. Was that fun? Okay, three points at all times. Teach them young here. Very, very safe around this kind of stuff. You always know what's around you. Ask me how I know that as a mechanic. I pointed my head pretty good on something uh, the other day. I wasn't paying attention to what was around me. So. Remy, how was that? Good. Good. What are we going to do now? Go in the big truck. On the big truck? Okay. Run! Go! 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 Hey! Let's go one. Now I ain't running stuff. Remy does, though. What are we doing now, boys? I'm going to go to the plane over here to unload the 
Well, we're going for a ride in the big truck, and the elevator's just down the road. Oh, it's so big for these little guys. Big Western star. Where are they going? Holy man, you two could live back there. Look at that. Half the horn, Andy. So boys, how's the weekend so far in our visit down to southern Ontario to Grandma and Grandpa's farm? Good. It was? Good. So yeah, I moved up to Muskoka about 13 years ago. I lived uh, kind of close to where I'm from, about an hour away. I was, did an apprenticeship to be a truck mechanic and then I moved up with a friend to uh, Muskoka. Happened to meet my wife there. And that's where our, I'm located now and there is no agriculture like that there. Like here, as I said before, so. Guys, look at all the poppies right there. A bunch of poppies right there. I already know that. Look at them all. We can't really. Oh, there, we're catching a glimpse. So, guys, how's your weekend been? Good. Good. And what have you done? Toys. What have we been doing? Combine. Combine and stuff that like that. Yeah. I always know that. So we're gonna go see some cows now in a big barn of somebody we know. Hopefully we can film there. Okay, we're gonna see the big move and go ooh. I'm gonna go up here. No, we're gonna stay down there. <laughs> big bunk in this truck. Whoa, look at this here. Remy, where's Wes? Right there. Right there. Oh! He's even got a window to look out up there. This is a nice machine. Unfortunately, it broke down the other day. The gearbox, the bearings went in it for the feeder here. That's the feeder. And um, closest gearbox in the States. Um, they couldn't find all the parts they'd need to rebuild it. So they found one out of uh, Wreckers. But it's the wrong gearbox. And they only found that out after they got it here. So my dad has been driving around all morning just to have the wrong part. Because there's two available ones, I guess, and the part system didn't show it. Something went loopy there, and it's the wrong gearbox, and it will not fit in there. So they're scrambling to try and find some bearings and stuff to get the other one rebuilt. They never break when you're not using them. 